My ex of 15 years is tripping on me for having a girlfriend of three years because she spent the nights and my kids were here and my ex is tripping. So let me ask you a question, Custom Fabs. Why does she even have access to you to be tripping on you? There's no ex, there's no ex of mine that has access to me like that for to even be tripping on me. Like I wouldn't even listen to nobody's concerns about what the fuck I'm doing with my life. You see what I'm saying? Why does your ex have that type of access to you? Why are you listening to her tripping on you? People can only trip on you if you allow them to trip on you. You know you're a grown fucking man, right? You know you don't have to allow people in your space, right? You know you don't have to talk to her, right? You know you don't have to listen to her, right? Because you know that you're a grown fucking man who controls who's in and out of your life. My kids told her, and now she's tripping on why my new girl... No, she's not tripping on you. You just weak as fuck, and she knows that, and you just an outlet to be a, a bitch to. you the one, the one of the few people in the world who allows her to be a bitch, and so she knows she can come to you and be a bitch. That's why. So nobody can't trip on you if you, like, how a person going to trip on me and I ain't listening to him? How is my ex going to trip on me and my woman if I don't answer the phone for her? <laughs> How she gonna trip on me? How she gonna trip on me if she texts me and I don't respond? You gotta grab your motherfucking balls and say, leave me alone. Don't bother me with that. You don't get to control what I do in my house. Cause I'm not trying to control what you do in your house. So fuck off. You gotta grab your balls and tell your ex to fuck off. You scared to tell your ex to fuck off and go get a fucking life and start worrying about what I do in my house? You too scared to cut the tie. You're going to let her ruin your new situation because you don't got a control over what you allowing, the type of drama you allowing another person to pour into your life. There's no fucking way I'd be sitting here happy with my woman and then my motherfucking baby mama talk about some bullshit and I'm listening to it. He talking about my ex tripping on me. Why is you listening to that shit? That's what I'm saying. Like you, y'all don't live together. Nothing. Like you don't have to answer the phone for her, bro. <laughs> you know you don't have to answer the phone, and you can put home. Do not disturb. You don't even have to read that shit. Like, but you choosing that. So y'all, a lot of y'all just don't got balls. That's why she left your ass, though. Y'all don't be having balls. You don't got. You can't stand up for yourself. Stand up for yourself, bro. Tell them if you don't go on somewhere with that bullshit. Fuck out of here. Kiss my motherfucking ass and take that shit to your, your new dude or something. Don't fucking call me with that bullshit again. I'm going to block your goofy ass. You got to talk to women like that, man. You call me with that bullshit again, I block your goofy ass. You got to deal with me through my mama. You got to stand up. You got to stand on business like that. Or they going to treat you like that.